Well, this Memorial Day will be the first since the official end of the pandemic. Many people are choosing to do so rather than travel out of state. Our Ray Strickland reports on how inflation is affecting travel for some this holiday weekend. Probably that way. Rob Hunt is starting his holiday weekend with his loved ones at Huron Clinton Metro Parks. He says a tight budget is one of the main reasons he's choosing to stay home this year. We don't really want to go anywhere. We'd rather stay home. More than a million Michiganders are planning to travel for Memorial Day weekend, but with rising costs due to inflation, some like Hunt are choosing a staycation to spend time with family while also saving money. Family time for free. Um, yeah, food prices are up too, so we'd we'd rather stay home and and hang out with our own. Hunt wasn't the only one at the park who decided to spend their holiday at home. Kurt Schiller and his wife say they typically take their boat up north, but even that can be too expensive, so they decided to stay close to home. We'll have a picnic, party, uh, play a little cornhole, um, have some beverages, and uh, have a good time. Detroit is one of the, the places that people love to go. With majority of Michiganders traveling by car, Chris Moyer from Visit Detroit is expecting many people to flock to the metro. He says there are many activities people can do without breaking the bank. It's downriver Detroit in Trenton, Michigan has the only international wildlife refuge in North America. Uh, the Detroit Riverfront International Wildlife Refuge, Belle Isle, the Detroit Riverwalk, the number one river walk in the country for three years in a row. There are so many inexpensive ways to get out, enjoy the beautiful Memorial Day weekend weather uh, without spending a lot of money. Now, there are so many options in the metro area. If you do decide to stay home, if you still need plans, you can check out all the events happening in our area. If you go to visitdetroit.com, again, that's visitdetroit.com. Reporting in Detroit, Ray Strickland, CBS News, Detroit.